first day of your weekend. Ooh. Happy first day of your weekend. Science stuff. <laughs> Ooh, this will be fun. Oh, intense music at the start. All right, new game. I kind of miss being at her house though, you know, at her desk. More challenging puzzles. Now nah, we always like amateur. I like to check stuff off. Technology of tomorrow. Today. Ooh, I don't like that sound. Oh. Nancy, Jeez. you made it. Good. You couldn't tell me much earlier. What's the story? You'll find all the information in Nico's desk drawer. The combination is 171943. Got it. I'll need full access to the lab and a cover. For the cover, say you're doing due diligence for a new investor. I'll back you up if anyone asks. But full access to the lab? No. It's too dangerous. If I can't investigate everything, I might have a problem on my hands. All right. I'll have Ellie set up a demo for you. But that's it. The equipment in this lab is extremely dangerous. Got it. Approach the case how you want, but I think I know where you should start. Ryan, the police really thought she might be behind Nico's murder. They just couldn't prove it. She built the machine that killed him, and supposedly she threatened him. Start there. I've got to leave the office. If you need me, I'll be on my phone. Good luck. Stay safe. And please, help me do right by Nico. He was a brilliant scientist and a good man. <laughs> Case solved. She did it. <laughs> um, oh, look at them teaching us how to play the game. We're off to a crazy start, as always. The equipment is dangerous. Immediately proceeds to snoop and set dangerous equipment. Okay, all right. Let's look. Let's look around. It what looks like here? it's missing the opening mechanism. Oh, ooh, we're gonna have to get some chocolate hmm. later. What is this? Okay, robot parrot. Nice, like it, like it. I need to find a way to fix this. Okay, gotta fix whatever that is. I don't wanna open his lock, his safe yet. Let's keep looking around his office. Got some interesting art pieces. All right, what do we got over here? Got a little doodads and some books, okay. Locked, of course. Nancy, why didn't you say it? It's locked. Any books I can click on? This music's rather interesting. Licky Lou, Moon Chunk is back. Yeah, Moon Chunk. Right here, Moon Chunk. What is this? I think it's just like a light, maybe? All right, let's go behind his desk. This must be the drawer where Victor put the case file. What was the number? One, seven, one, nine, four, three. Nice. Nancy, here are the notes from the police investigation. Keep the contents of the file to yourself and do not remove it from Nico's office. If anyone should discover the file on you, your cover will be blown. Oh, okay. All right, victim, Nico Jovic, 
PhD, 61 years old, theoretical physicist, co-owner of Technology of Tomorrow Today facility. Body discovered in Tesla Coil Lab by Ellie York at 12.13 a.m. Ellie York is this lady. Body recovered by coroner. Cause of death confirmed as electrocution by a high voltage discharge of the Tesla coil. Don't play with zappy stuff, chat. It looks like a lamp. Yeah, it does look like a lamp. I think I like the click action on this one. It looks nicer than the previous game. It does, doesn't it? Victim, okay, background. Victim was widely acclaimed as a genius in his field, known to have poor social skills, perceived as unfriendly or uncaring, even antagonistic by co-workers, never married, no immediate family living. Okay. Crime scene evidence victims' expertise and decades of experience in wireless energy and the high-level safety features built into the Tesla coil's operating procedure indicate against victims' death uh, as a workplace accident. Victim deaths is therefore regarded as suspicious. All right, personnel. Lab access restricted to employees only by secure key card entry. You got Mason Quinto. Quinto. Research assistant day shift claims to have been on a date at time of death, but according to his date, they had parted ways by 10.30 p.m. Dislike a victim evident during questioning. Okay. All right, so these are our list of suspects, guys. Ellie York, research assistant, night shift. On time at, uh, on site at time of death, called 911 to report incident. Update, left town the following evening. Ryan Kilpatrick, technical engineer day shift, stated that she was driving back to the lab from Colorado Springs at time of death, appeared distraught, evasive, and nervous during questioning, built the machine that killed victim. <laughs> All of them are so sus, but I love that they do this. Uh, Gray Courtright, head of security night shift, on site at time of death, um, taciturn, taciturn recall, re, recalcitrant, recalcitrant? and unfriendly towards police. Sorry, I've never seen that word before. Refused to speak of his relationship with the victim. Coworkers seemed uncertain as to how he has continued to keep his position. Okay. Victor Lasset, library co-owner, office on site, off site, oversees business and financial decisions, stated he was working alone in off site office at time of death. Okay, all of these guys do not have good alibis. You already think it's Victor? You think so? Because <laughs> he's the other co-owner and he wanted to be the owner? Maybe. He's watched, he looks like he's watched a few people die. <laughs> he does have that Turkish Olympic shooter look about him. <laughs> Pointed a finger at someone else at the start, give a big compliment gave a big compliment to Nico Overseas Business. Wait, where do you see the compliment? <laughs> All right, note, suspect question failed to provide an ironclad alibi for any employee. Key card log records indicate another entry shortly before victim death. Oh, he said something nice during the video call. Oh yeah, that was him. Sorry, I... Didn't pay attention to who it was I was talking to. <laughs> to be fair, though, I got distracted. But anyways, um, victims asked about security video. That number obtained from head of security showed no one entering the lab from the time of victim's entrance until the until after his time of death. The key card used to enter the lab after victim has not been recovered from premises and does not match any key card ID in the logs. Interesting. It is believed a power surge occurred on site as a result of coil tests being run shortly before victim's death, causing a glitch in the log system. Witness statements and crime scene evidence suggest Ryan Kilpatrick as the prime suspect. She was arrested and brought to the police station for interrogation. 
After a lengthy questioning, Ryan Kilpatrick was released due to lack of concrete evidence, but remains a person of interest. No further leads at this time. Case re remains open, unsolved. Crime scene decontaminated and lab's office and surrounding rooms restored to pre-incident state. Personal belongings of victim recovered as evidence, including files and experiment notes, shall remain in police possession for further investigation. Scientific equipment has been released back to lab. Secured site reopened to scientific use. All right. <laughs> Clearly a co-owner could make a new card. True. <laughs> we already found our guide. Time to go arrest him. Okay, let's keep looking around. Is there anything else? I don't think there's anything else in the office. All right, let's see. What's this way? I did nothing. I don't know why the music is so intense Hello, right Nancy. now. I forgot to tell you. We've been having a lot of outages lately. Where's the Funny you mentioned that. I think you're that? having one right now. It's nothing to worry about. We've got backup on the big systems. Most of the time, Gray can get things back online in an hour. Occasionally, it takes a while, but rarely does it come close to the critical window. Critical window? Some of the equipment can get unruly when the power supply isn't consistent. Don't worry about it, though. Take the time to get settled. Catch up on sleep. All right. Gotta run. Excuse me? Okay, what's that? Ugh, come on. Nancy. Ow, my toe. Ooh. Is this my bed? Oh my god, I literally just guessed. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Um, let's set it to morning, I guess. The heck? <laughs> Is Nancy going to die already? Uh-oh. This was not what I expected when I set the alarm. I got to go to the bathroom. A clue. No, wait. That's just a sink. It's an arm! Looks like that cat arm. Okay, how do I turn off the buzzing? I need to find the power knob before I can use it. Okay, no breakfast. All right, okay. Oh my god! You come with me. What's going on? No chit chat. Come, now. All right. We need to get the system shut down Not before cozy. the grid goes critical. Get all those switches what? powered off. I'll do the rest. What? How? Oh, okay. What do I do? Could this have been used to keep the power on? I need to keep this together with any other evidence I find. Oh, suspicious. Nice work. Now get out. Who are you? What just happened? If the grid had gone critical, we'd all be dead right now. I'm Gray. I don't care who you are. Don't tell me. Get out! Wow! I promise I did not know how to do that before. No way! I need to speed run this game! What the heck? <laughs> Pro gamer. Save it. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that guy is so it's unfriendly. Locked. I need a car to get oh. in the lab. Okay, so that's the lab. I want to go back to where we were. There's so much to see right now. Oh, boy. Periodic table of elements. Guess what? We're going to take a photo of this. Oops. We're going to take a photo of it. I think we're going to need it for later. Also, what is that? Ooh, clear. Okay. Messages, settings. Oh, look, it's the tomb. Wallpaper. Professor Sparrow. Literal desktop. Queen's entrance. Haunted. Ooh, love it. Ooh, Waverly. Let's do haunted. We're gonna leave that alone. 
right. Mad scientist or genius? <laughs> Great job. Thanks, chat. Zoom out. Oh, was I... Oh. Was it too zoomed? Oh, yeah, you're right. There we go. That's a better one. Okay. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Where was our... Where was... Where were... Where... Should we press it? Oh, probably not. Push it? Should we have pushed it? Is this the creator of the Tesla coil? Is that who this is? We can, we call, who can we call? Good question. <gasps> Not Ned! We haven't seen Ned the past two games. We got Frank and Joe Hardy and Victor. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, I can't click on any of those books. Why are these books even here then? Okay. Stop the madness! Prevent office supplies kidnapping! Do not remove! Hmm. 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 Huh. Huh. Oh, that's it. Ooh, what's this? Aggregation? All right, Mason. What do we have to do? Aggregation. The object of aggregation is to clear the board by matching three or more pieces of the same color. To make a match, uh, pieces must be adjacent. What is this font? Uh, to make a match, pieces must be adjacent either vertically or horizontally or both without being separated by a wall. You can send a piece out from any of the four tracks surrounding the board if it will hit another piece already on the board or wall in higher levels. The next piece shows you what's coming up next on the track. Additional helper and hazard pieces. Wild, wall, shield, bomb, cloner. I win! <laughs> Ned and Nancy on a break? I don't know, man. There was that one episode where it was like really shaky with their relationship, remember? Yeah, don't jinx it. Maybe they just couldn't afford uh, him or something. I don't know. Oh, I see. Oh, I see how this can get weird. Oh, darn it. I'm in trouble. Wait, no, I'm not. I am. Wait, they said it could be diagonal, right? Mason, I'll come back. Well, at least we know how to play the game. All right, what did we have? Out of order. Um, can't even huh. make food because I need whatever knob is that there. Okay. Is there? Can we go to? Can you go to the TV? And this is just my bedroom. The life and times of Nikola Tesla. Oh, I was right. It is him. He's a genius visionary. Nice. We'll come back to that. Okay. Let's keep looking around. Let's just see. 
Interesting. What did that do? Did that get him out of the lab? Ooh, what did that do? It's locked. Darn it. What happened? What was that? I heard people, I heard somebody running. What was that? Who left? Maybe the cranky guy? Maybe. Ooh, interesting. So maybe that's a way we can like get him to leave. Oh, here we go, security. Oh yeah, look, he's gone. Ooh, W, G, G. Ooh, what is this? Zap up, charges remaining. Uh, all right, that's nice. Let's keep looking around before he comes back in. Oh. Hmm. Hard here? Hmm. Maybe the security guy was the one who did it because he can make an extra key card. What is with all these letters? There's like an F and a Z and an R. Full power! If five charges, when fully powered, stations send out additional charges in all directions. Cat is alive. Unlock all binaries. Okay. Oh, I don't want to leave yet. Okay, nothing else? Oh. Oh. So how does this work? Oh, I see. Oh, darn it. What was that one that clicked that did everything? <laughs> I like this sound. Feels like I'm in a casino. I'm winning big money, chat big money. I have two remaining now. Oh, darn it. I was pretty Oh, I did it. Woo! Oh, nice. Wait. It could be binary. I bet there's something here that could help me decode this. What is that? What was that bloop sound? Did you finish the Egyptian one? I did. We finished it yesterday. It had a very um, interesting ending. <laughs> Zero, 15, this is the chain. So then you're supposed to go around, unlock all binaries. It says, it says it right here. Zero to 15. But like, how do you even solve it? Like what? It's just a screen. Am I supposed to like, say so I click on that, but I can't click on. It's like looking at something, I'm guessing. I don't really know. This is what that letter, what the letters are for. They are all on a gear with an arrow pointing in a direction. Oh, you're right. But like, how do you even solve it? That's the question. How do you solve it? Like, say we have all the letters and stuff, like what? Is that guy gonna come back? <laughs> Can't check that off yet. Did that. Oh, this was the, so this is the password. Oh wow, look at how they do the hints this time. That's interesting. Have a, did, th did that. Can't check that off. That's done. That's done. Check. Haven't done that. Maybe type in a sequence. 
Yeah, typing doesn't do anything. And I can't use this keyboard here. And I can't click. Nothing is here either. It's okay, maybe maybe I wasn't supposed to solve it this fast. <laughs> it's okay, let's uh let's leave before the guy comes back and he's like super cranky. Should we go down the elevator? Should we go up or down? Oh, we can only go up. I guess this is the basement floor. Or first floor. I already got jump scared. What the heck? <laughs> Let's go talk to Ellie. Can I help you? It's what brings nice you cubicle. here? School? Actually, I'm checking the lab out for a new potential owner. Oh yeah, Nancy, right? Yes. Ellie, Victor wanted me to show you the coil. I guess you could say you're lucky. Most people never get to see the inside of the lab. And we're not exactly up to giving tours, considering. Ready? Bye, Kai. Have a good nap. Pretty impressive, isn't it? Is this the coil that was responsible for Nico's death? Yes. It's been rewired since that night. It never should have been set up that way in the first place. Why was it wired that way? There must have been a reason, right? Now, I need you to focus on what we are doing. It's very dangerous. What you're in right now is called a Faraday cage. Well, how does it this work? kind of freaky. Basically, it conducts the electricity away from whatever is inside it, keeping you safe. Here we go! This is fear tactics of working. Okay, that's it. Back to the office. Thanks for the demo. Any chance you could let me look around in the lab sometime? Nope. Alrighty then. <laughs> okay. I was not expecting that to happen. I know, my ears. It was really loud. Jeez, okay. Alright. Well, let's ask her a few questions. Can you tell me what you do at the lab? In plain terms, I'm a research scientist. How long have you worked here? Some days feels like decades. I don't actually know. Two years? Maybe a bit less. Do you share the office? In a way. Mason's station is over there. He's in during the day. Okay. You said the coil should never have been wired the way it was the night Nico died. Why not? Wiring the secondary and primary coils together is a good way to get yourself killed. Or someone else. Are you sure it was Ryan? Yes. Why would she do that? She said Nico insisted. Does that sound like something Nico would do? I never understood him. But if he was even a fraction as smart as his work leads me to believe, why would he do something so dangerous? She's kind of sus though. She's giving off like creepy aura vibes, you know what I mean? Like here, let me show you the quail and don't talk to me because this is dangerous. Zap, 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 zap. Is there a way into the lab without a key card? No. Trust me, I've tried. I'm not great at remembering to bring my card. Oh. And Gray does not like letting me in. Goodbye. Bye. Okay. Maybe it's just like the the soft, like calm way she's saying it is kind of creepy. I wouldn't do that if I were you. Mason's not very forgiving. You don't want to be messing with his stuff. Wait, oh, he's not there? Sorry, I was just a little curious. You know, he's not here. Make you a deal. He's been lording his high score aggregation over me. <gasps> Take him down, and I'll let you poke around. I better get so going. That's the Mason. Goodbye, Nancy. We have to knock off his, his score. Okay. Ooh, what's that? Mysterious. Who didn't use a coaster? 
staring into your soul. <laughs> yeah, we have to see, but we have to beat the score naturally. Nancy has skills. Office rivalry. I do know. I do like that. Tesla Cole is a user's guide to lower voltage stress. We replace the old single cap with a multi miniature capacitor matrix. The MMC will charge only when there is no other cap of a similar color rating in the same row or column. Ryan replaced part in spark cap with one made to her modifications. Note for future tests. Now, coil won't run without the new part in place. Okay. How much you want to bet? We're going to be, we're going to have to, oh, what is this? Circuitry. We're going to have to be doing something with this and probably fix the Tesla coil maybe. Oh, I can take it. Oh, okay. Perfect. I'll just take that with me. Hey, what is that from, guys? Does that look familiar? Can y'all name what that's from? I love when they do these little things on Nancy Drew. But you wouldn't catch it unless you've, like, played in a lot. <laughs> okay, what else? We, oh, I think, I think that's it. Is there any... Oh, what's this? Uh, Binary Buster presents 15 things you never knew about electricity. The first electric lighthouse was the Statue of Liberty. An electric eel can produce 650 volt shock. The largest electrical blackout to date cut power to over 600 million people in India in 2012. You can light, that sucks. You can light up a burnt out fluorescent bulb in your hand using a Tesla coil. Lightning can carry up to one billion volts. The phenomenon called St. Elmo's fire is actually luminous plasma around a grounded object in an electric field. Electrical field. Okay. El St. Elmo's fire. Voltage doesn't kill people. Current kills people. Currents as low as 60 milliampers can be, amperes can be lethal. The lightning rod was invented by Benjamin Franklin. What was that sound? Y'all hear that? Fireflies are 90% more efficient at producing light than incandescent light bulbs. Silver is the best metal for conducting electricity, followed by copper, then gold. We're probably going to need to know this later, so I'm reading it. Humphrey Davy invented an electric, electric light bulb in 1802, more than 70 years before the Edison bulb. The first electric... Also, wait, what are these things? Why are the... Why are there red and blue dots? Anyways, silver is the best. Oh wait, uh, the electric. The first electric car was built in 1828. Static electricity was first described in the sixth century BC by Thales of Miletus. Got an adapter. There are 12 different standard outlet plugs around the world. Nikola Tesla created the longest ever man-made lightning bolt at a record 130 feet. Seven ways to be energy efficient. Replace standard light bulbs with compact fluorescents. Stop the electronic vampires. Unplug electronics when they're not in use. Dry your clothes the old fashioned way on a clothesline. Use a programmable thermostat. Keep it clean. Replace cooling and heating system filters yearly. Oh, this is binary? Know that you want, know what you want before you open the fridge. Oh, keep. Oh yeah, uh, turn the lights off when you leave the room. This has been a blank out of zero announcement. Interesting. I was wondering when you'd see that. <laughs> what the dots? <laughs> like what is that? What is that sound? Let me in, let me in. Jerk. Okay, all right, let's go to Oh, is there only two floors? I guess there's only two floors. Who here knows binary? Thanks, Lulu. <laughs> no coaster on the nice wood? <laughs> Would drive me nuts too, don't worry. Okay, so she said that we need to get the highest score in order to snoop through his stuff. So let's get the highest score. We have to beat 22,500. 
Binary values are 8421, so 000x is 1 and is 1, and 00xx is 3, uh, 2 plus 1. Okay. We're probably going to need, that's probably going to give us some kind of, I don't know, number password thing later, so we'll have to go back. Oh, I should have taken a photo. Oh well. Oh well. Let's, let's focus. Um, I did really bad the last time. Maybe I'll do better this time. Oh, so much better. Doing it? I'm doing it 14,000. I don't like this. Uh... Mason only made it to level five and needs to step up his game. Look at us. I'm only on four and I already feel like I did it wrong. <laughs> Darn it. What do I do? Whatever. I'll do that. Oh, here we go. Dang it. Ooh. Oh, dang it. Darn you. I have this one, but I can't do anything with it. Oh. Hmm. What else can I do? Ooh, that got rid of the green. Uh, this doesn't count, right? Like the, if I put this here, this wouldn't count, would it? The one, two, three? No, all oh, darn it didn't count. <laughs> Dang you! Okay, whatever, I'm gonna put that there. Oh, that counts though, okay. Okay, we're we're getting somewhere. I should not have put that there. Do we do a different one? Am I at least getting points for doing this? <laughs> I haven't been paying attention. Oh, I am getting points. So I guess I still can, uh, I'd rather just clear the level. Oh boy. Darn it. Oh, here we go. Just need one little blue one. Just one little blue one. <gasps> now I just need one little green. Darn you! Why is it always the next one? Oh, here we go. We did it. Yes. Level five. Okay. Ew. What is that? A wall. How dare you? How dare you? Oh my god, I did not mean to do that. Pain. Oh, that one's done. This 
is a wild. Just throw that in there. Woo! Um, dang it! That yellow one wasn't in the way. Or this green one. Oh, here we go. Okay, that gets. Okay, okay. All right, let's get rid of the yellow. Nice, nice. Let's get rid of the blue. Nice. We're doing it. Hmm. The walls, I guess, could be a little nice to, oh, well, that sucks. Oh, not, no, it doesn't. Hmm. So I, if I put this here, this wouldn't count because there's a wall there. That's dumb. That's dumb. I'll put this here. <gasps> okay. That was nice. Hmm. I want this green to go away. Maybe we put the yellow there. Dang it! Got the green on this side. Ugh. Oh, here we go. Yes. I don't know why I did that. I looked at that wrong. <laughs> Darn it. What was the score I needed to get again? 22,000 something, right? Oh, this is not bad. Oh, yeah, it is. Um, hmm. Oh. Sure, why not? Darn you, darn yellow. Can you even lose? I'm assuming no. 22,050? Okay. I'm assuming you can't lose. So many yellow. <laughs> um. Oh, there we go. Wow, I got all four gone. Okay, I didn't know I could do that. Okay. Get rid of the blue. Hmm. Darn it, I'm a little, I kind of a little trapped here. Something. Um, yellow. Oh! <gasps> 
super focused mode. Why is this? Why do we have to get his tough score? Jeez. Oh my god. Um. Okay. Let's see here. We got a blue and a blue. And a yellow is coming up. Hmm. That is not bad. Maybe, uh, here? Got a green. The problem is having to think about what's next. We go. Just came back from running the dishwasher. Kylie's meta gamer most. Trying. Um. Oh, I thought I heard something. Can y'all give me just one second, real quick? Hold on. Never mind. Just star uh, freaking apartment complex being stupid. Okay. Anyways, mm, let's see. This wouldn't work. Oh my god. I need a place to put the blue. Oh shoot. That probably was not a good spot. Hmm. This is not bad. That takes away the that. Ooh, this takes away the blue. This goes away. Orange arrow and wild card. Oh, that could have worked. Okay, green goes away. Okay, is there any way? Oh, perfect. Oh. <gasps> Oh, I have the new highest score. Does it save? That was actually not that bad. Okay, does it save? Now can I stop? I don't want to keep going. Look, Nancy, 24,000. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, okay, so now we can go snoop through the, that guy's, that guy's stuff. Oh, goodness. Uh, which was upstairs, right? Didn't keep going, not getting a pro gamer achievement then. I don't care to. Okay, where was their office? Oh, not in there. Where's their office? This way? Here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's go tell her so that Hi. she'll let us snoop through his stuff. <laughs> I beat Mason's high score. You did good, kid. This is me looking the other way. It's a limited time offer. I'll let you go. Bye. Ha 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 ha. Ooh. Okay, we got his... Is this his password that he leaves on a sticky note right next to his computer? Nice, very secure. Oh. Oh, we can mess his stuff up. <laughs> Interesting. Biometrics at an introduction. Um, 
Biometric is a security method that uses unique personal physical traits to act as keys or passwords. Iris and retina scans, voice recognition, facial shape, fingerprints are commonly used biometric indicators. Fingerprint biometric is gaining prevalence um, as an additional security measure in many industries as a replacement for traditional door locks. Um, instead of using a key or pass card, the user places their finger on a scanner which captures their fingerprint. The scan is run against a user database. If a match is found, the lock is released. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Wait, is this the password? One, five... Seven, two, one, two, five. Oh, it didn't work. Okay, so maybe that's not it. Hmm. Well, it's whoa. Circuit theory. Oh, why are why are all of these yellow? E E O. K A. Maybe that spells out his password? Or maybe that's the hangman thing. Symbol key, Wheeler's formula, copper wire ratings, blah, blah, blah. What is all of this? Okay. Let's see, is there anything else I can look through? Oh, no, that's it. So we have to. Fi Do you think this is his password? The, all the yellows. Maybe we have to make out a word with the hangman thing. Why are there music notes? I don't know. <laughs> also, hold on one second. Okay, there we go. Um, maybe try it. Okay, so we got. I get. Do I need paper? Hold on. Let me, let me write it down, I guess. Okay, so we got E, E, O, M, A, N, W, T, Man, words on stream's gonna come in clutch. <laughs> Cause we maybe maybe we'll be able to figure out what the heck was that sound? What this word spells. Okay. Oh. Oh what an L. So I get all of them? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Okay. Paper, a notebook. Um, let me put it in chat. Okay, so we got E E O M A N T W S. Oh, it's not typing. E E O M A N W T S S T H O L. Okay, there. Those those are those are the letters we're working with. What are the letters behind your cam? Wait, what? Oh, a W. It's just a W. Um, we have an apostrophe, so that has to be an apostrophe S. So we already have one down. So something apostrophe S. <laughs> um, the last letter of the first word looks to be S. Yes, the last letter of the first word. If it was more than a W. Oh, do you mean the symbol key? Yeah, I wish there was a better way. Um, well, actually, maybe there is. Maybe I can move my... Maybe I can move my camera, like, all the way down here. And then I wouldn't be hiding anything. No, I'm still hiding something. <laughs> It's annoying. 
Uh, hi, Snow. How are you? You adopted a kid and named her Maple? That's sweet. That's sweet. I like that. Uh, yeah, I don't even know if I think this... No, I'm gonna move it back up. Anyways. Um, there's other letters, yes. But the ones that were behind my camera is a W and that's it. That, that's orange, at least. No. Are we able to find this out? Haven't done that's did that. That's done. Hello from Russia. Hello from the United States. Woman? It could be woman. Woman's W O M A N S apostrophe woman's. Let's see. What if we do that? Woman's. What else? What other letters would we have? We would have both E's, a T, two T's, an S, an H, and an L. Do you think, wait, maybe it's Tesla, because that would make sense, Tesla, oh, but there's not, oh, Teslas, Teslas, I'm trying to think, I feel like Tesla has to be a word, right, Teslas, We would need, if that's the case, we would still have one E, one O, one M, N, W, one more T, H, O, that's it. E O M N W T H O Tesla's hometown <gasps> Tesla's hometown Oh my god y'all are so good Okay I don't know his hometown but we can find that out Not this right There was a book where did we find that book Tesla's hometown Oh my god you guys are so good Nancy's room Okay okay Tesla's hometown, so that's probably the password to his, his lock, or his uh, computer. Wait, you already know? Croatia? Sim, simili, so do you think it's simil, similijan? S M I L. J A N. We don't need to know the province, right? Okay. Let's assume that's it. Okay. Heck yeah. Woohoo! Woohoo! Exciting. At least I'm assuming the password isn't Tesla's hometown, but it's like the actual hometown. If that makes sense. Okay, so S M I L J A N. It worked! Oh! Whoa, what's this? I'm 
I made a smiley face! Alright, a uh, record repository. Um, alright, camera adjustments. Okay, I don't know if this is anything out of the ordinary, but guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna take a photo of this. Trash. Whoa, Ryan Whoa. should never have been released. Better follow up on this. Ryan should have never been released? <gasps> Evidence. <laughs> See this video? Oh! Okay. Component craze. How fast can you make all the matches? Begin. Do I win anything? What in the matching game? What was it, Fuse? This one? This one. a lot more photos than I normally do. <laughs> okay, hopefully I didn't touch anything at, on his desk, so maybe he'll, I don't know if he's gonna freak out or not. Look at the plant lady, I love her. Oh, Nancy, what's up? Goodbye, oh, why goodbye Nancy. Like oh, four months old, how cute. She's not happy to see us, no she's not. All right, well, we figured out what his password Check. was. We need to snoop her area next. Haven't done that. All right, right. We need to go and check, like... We need to go check the videos. So that's security, right? How do we check the security videos? Sheldon is from Big Bang Theory. <laughs> if you've ever watched that. Um... Oh, see, he's here. Don't know you. Who let you in? But we've already met in the lab. <sighs> Never mind. I'm Nancy. I'm here doing research for a new owner. Just what this place needs. You're not a fan of the idea? Nope. Why not? Not a fan of most ideas. That's a strange attitude for someone who works at a research facility. <laughs> <laughs> Might be. What do you think of Ellie? What did you say all these questions were for again? I'm gathering information for a potential new owner. Your questions say different. Say you're lying. Okay, you got, got me. me. <laughs> Great, don't care. Keep the question count low and we'll get along. What do you do here? Job description says security agent. Suppose it's more valid than not. How long have you worked here? Don't know. Can you estimate? Mm, nah. You're really not going to tell me how long you've worked here? So it would seem. I better get going. Bye. Video. 
Should I make him leave again? Does the pattern on his shirt mean something? Oh, I didn't... <laughs> what? <laughs> Maybe. Didn't ask why his computer was on when he got back. Oh. Oh, yeah, he didn't. <laughs> Maybe he thought he forgot to turn it off or something. Aw, that's sweet, Snow. How cute. Oh, I love kittens. Here, let's make him... Oh. Wait, was there, oh, there's nothing out. Oh. No, I don't have anything new. All right, let's make him leave. See, I think he went into the lab. But how do I even, oh, this is, Oh, because we saw the other thing. I guess I didn't take a photo of it. Oh, but, okay, well now what? Let's see what it said. It said zero to 15 and then go around starting with the third chain, I guess. Unlock all binaries. So third chain, so maybe this one, we start with this one, and then we go around. But like, how do we know? Oh. Oh, do we have to, oh. Oh no, what? Okay. <laughs> what? One, two, three. One, two, one, oh, wait. oh, I see. Oh, God. type of puzzles if I'm gonna be real with you normally I just wing it <laughs> ah These must be the key cards used to access the lab. I should figure out which number belongs to whom. Man, today is my day, guys. It is my day. Pro Gamer Times 2. <laughs> All right, lab access. 10, 15. If I'm gonna be real with you, I was totally guessing, but it worked. All right. All right. The thing is, I don't remember when people went. Like, what? How did I? That number is from the night of the murder. <gasps> it doesn't appear anywhere else in the logs. Which one? What? Which one? System offline. Oops, wait. I went, meant to take a photo wait which one is Nancy talking about oh the eight five one one six five one eight that's the night of the murder 
at 12.04 a.m. And then system override. Interesting. Security! Oh, perfect! Okay, so there's one that we needed to look at. Uh, what was it called again? Oh, here we go. We have to look at this video. So, L B P Y five oops five one zero uh, two five eight. Who is that? Oh, is that the guy that died? Oh, yeah. Okay, so this is a video of him. Just Nico. Hmm. This is the, I guess this is, I'm assuming this is the only door. All right, and then let's find the one with Ryan. So we got H L L W five one zero two five seven. Play. Okay, this is also the entrance to the lab at 11.34 p.m. on 10.23. Wait, what is she doing? She didn't even, wait, she didn't even scan her key card. She just went in. She's bypassing the security system. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Key cards. Hold on, that was 10.23 at, what time was that? Oh wait, she, these are key cards, she didn't even use a key card. So, wait, what time, what time was that? Anyways, it goes to show that she's not using a key card, so it doesn't matter. All right, let's do this one. Okay. 185. Maybe we can try the thing that was written on Mason's desk. Three, four, seven, two, one, two, five. No. Okay, so I don't know. I don't know what kind of password we need for this. Yeah, figure out the password. Activate the key card program. Did that. That's done. That's done. Did that. We still haven't met everybody at the lab. If we can get the password of this, maybe we can make our own key card and then go into the, the lab ourselves. But I don't know when that would happen. Probably not yet. Probably not for a little while. The music was freaking me out. Why was it so intense? Okay. You know what? Maybe the reason why we haven't met everyone is because... Um... Because they're like day and night shift. So I forgot who was day shift, who was night shift. I also don't know what time right now it is. <laughs> I'm assuming it's daytime? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't tell me the time. One, seven, one, nine, four, three. I guess we can figure out. If we met Ra Ellie, she's night shift, so I guess it's nighttime right now. So we need to go on day shift. Okay, so we've met Gray, we met Victor, we haven't met Ryan or Mason. And Ryan and Mason are both day shift, so maybe it's nighttime, that's why. Okay, let's make it daytime then. Oops. I literally thought pressing that button was gonna set off the fire alarm. <laughs> but it didn't, ha 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 Try that again, I don't think it would be the same one. Okay, let's set it to daytime, nice. Daytime! All right, let's go find Mason and Ryan. Oh, phone call. Hey there, Nancy Drew. Deirdre? Hi, Deirdre. Deirdre? Are you in Colorado by any chance? Why is she yes. calling? Yes, how did you know? 
Some friend of my dad's called me for a reference for you. And you gave him a good reference? Well, I told him the truth. That was very nice of you. Was it? By the way, don't make a habit of it. Okay? Bye. Wait, hang on a sec. I might need some outside help with this case. <sighs> Did you forget that I don't like you? No, but I know you're studying criminology and maybe someday I could help you out. Oh, a non-specific promise with the word someday. Sounds too tempting to ignore. Yet, here I go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now. All right, let's go find these people. Look at that a scrumptious, not terrifying box of cereal. With this um, girl. Hello, kids. <laughs> you too can get your face on the box. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> Usually, people that can that get in this game are people that won like a contest. But I don't know if they do that anymore. I have a feeling that now they wouldn't be able to do that. Because normally to be put in a game, or I don't know, maybe they could still do that. I don't know. If they get if you get permission and you sign like a contract saying that you won't sue them. <laughs> like what if you come because that's like a kid, that's like your child. I don't know. I would love it though. There's definitely a waiver. Yeah, there must have already been one. So maybe they can still do it. But I've always wanted to be in a Nancy Drew game. I see all these kids with their photos. But I'm not a child. So maybe... Hmm, maybe I can pose with my nephew. And then they'll be like, sold. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm going to take a photo of this. Oops. Oh yeah, look. We can call Dear... <laughs> Saving all the photos, all the evidence. Okay, let's go and see if Mason's here. Ah, oh, he is. If it looks like I'm busy, that means I'm busy. What are you working on? It's immensely complicated. Get a postgrad in advanced math and electrical engineering, then I'll explain it to you. Put it in layman's terms. Fine. There's this shiny magic that lives in the power lines, and it's dangerous and sly like a fox. And I'm using math to trick it into leaving the power lines, without accidentally making everyone die. That sounds like you're working on the wireless transmission of electricity to me. If you want to put too fine a point on it, go ahead, stranger. Which brings me to my next point. Who am I? Please let the answer be something that justifies me kicking you out of my workspace. I'm here on behalf of a new potential owner. Wrong. No, that's correct. No, I mean wrong answer for me. Not the answer I wanted to hear. Who hurt you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Do you know why Ryan would want to hurt Nico? The police already asked the same thing. Well, what did you tell them? I said if I were to have killed Nico, it'd be because he stole my work. Whoa, hold on. It's just a for instance. Is it? Yes. Is That's it? because I think logically. I force myself to think from A to B to C and so on. Ryan is all over the place. For her, it's A to zucchini, to that thing from TV, to maybe C, then on to some non sequitur. I don't trust anyone I can't explain. Did you see? I beat your high score. Oh my god, we're gonna rub it in. Yes. Out. If fighting is sure to result in victory, then you must fight. Sun Tzu compels me to take you down. Prepare yourself, opponent. Sun Tzu? Did you work directly with Nico? No one worked with Nico. We barely spoke to each other. That's the way he liked it. <laughs> He practically lived in the lab. From a to zucchini, if he wanted to look at my work, he'd just root around in my hard drive. So he'd come in here when you were gone? No, he'd use the network. 
He just snoop in your files? That seems kind of annoying. Not kind of. Entirely. It's unethical, and it allowed him to steal. Oh. What do you remember about the day Nico died? More than I'd care to. I imagine. Did anything stick out? Yes, the police. It was weird. One of us killed Nico, and here they were, talking about a basketball game, like it was any other day. What? What else do you remember? I remember Ryan. They took her out in cuffs. She came back the next day. Never said a word about what happened. You mentioned Nico stealing your work. Can you prove that? No. Yeah. You that must was... be pretty upset about that. Say what you really want to say. Did the police know your feelings about Nico? What a peculiar question. Do you have a peculiar answer? I do, in fact, have a peculiar answer. I actually told the police the truth. A more interesting question is how is Ryan still a free woman? Why shouldn't she be? In this case, the smoking gun is a miswired Tesla coil that she built. When I was snooping through his desk earlier, Dallas, I was able to like move the stuff and like mess it up. <laughs> I, I put it back. I'm assuming if you mess it up, he'll assume that somebody's been through his stuff. So <laughs> I didn't want to freak him out. Did you Not dislike yet. Nico? Very much so. Would you go as far as to say you hated Nico? I would go that far and further. That guy was a jerk. That seems a little disrespectful, considering... Does it? Am I supposed to pretend he's great now that he's dead? Lots of jerks have died, and he's one of them. He's a dead, brilliant, jerk madman. The world would be much better off if he'd lived to share more of his intellect. But I selfishly am glad I'll never have to deal with him again. It seems strange to me that you could be so blasé about a murder. I deal with things on my own time. But if you are desperate to watch someone cry, Ellie's always available. What do you think of Ellie? She hates me so much that she switched to the night shift. Come to think of it, she hates me so much I should actually feel a sense of accomplishment. Which I now do. There it is. What did you do that she dislikes you so much? Why do you assume it was me? I took an educated guess. I did too. Still couldn't figure it out. But the fact remains, we are not besties, as she likes to say. We are worsties. <laughs> not besties, worsties. Whoa. This is the grown-up version of all the kiddos I've worked with who have social skill issues. <laughs> really? The writing for this game has really captured how terrible some people are. Yeah. The worsties, as we would say, yeah. What's so special about Tesla? If you have to ask that, you haven't done your research. I mean, to you, what brought you here? The work. I turned down Los Alamos in a tenure-track position to be here. Wow. Most people don't know this, but the majority of Tesla's work was confiscated by the FBI. Why? Could be he was designing weapons. Could be he had a breakthrough that threatened the energy magnates. Don't know. It's all been hidden. What matters is, there's a little bit still here. I always suspected Nico had some squirreled away, and I'd be able to find it. But either he didn't, or I couldn't. Hmm, interesting. So it seems he has ulterior motive for being here. Don't let the turkeys get you down. <laughs> The, clear, the clever and witty writing is one of my favorite things about Nancy games. Mm -hmm. You said you were searching for Nico's Same. work. Did you Love ever this. look in Nico's personal things? Of course I looked. Can you tell me a little bit about Gray? He always gives me an industrial-sized portion of the creeps. The only person who ever liked Gray was Nico. Now this is and office And I think he just drama. liked keeping Gray around to scare everyone away from his work. Did he try to scare you away from Nico's work? No. He tried to scare me away from my own work. What does that mean? He was Nico's heavy. I figured he'd leave once the police gave the all clear. Trust me, if he's still here, he's up to something. Your boss would be smart to get rid of him.
What was Nico working on before he died? There wasn't a name for it yet, officially. It was basically wireless energy transfer. That was helpful for you. So how about you tell me something about your boss? I'm sorry, I can't. Confidential. What are you doing? I want you to tell me what you know, but I can't tell if you're a pushover or not. Not. Ah, efficiency. One of the rare graces of a post manner society. Goodbye. See you later. I can't tell if you're a pushover or not. It's like the savage group that I try to apply it to. <laughs> um, let's see. So we still did have that. to do that. Oh, no, we didn't do that. We have to investigate Ryan, but I don't know where she is. Can't check that off yet. That's can't haven't done okay, that. Here we go. What a guy. What are yeah. you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Let me let what are me you snoop. Doing? Why does he hates her? Let me yes. snoop. The, she Goodbye. let me snoop. See you later. Man. Darn you. He let me snoop though. Or she let me snoop. Oh, what's in here? Oh, this one. Oh, ooh, okay. Nice. What's a motorcycle doing in here? I'm guessing it's. <laughs> oh my god! I'm I almost so died. sorry about that. Are we cool? Um, yes. What? Good. I just, was really hoping what? you'd be the type not to freak out about something like that. Not that you shouldn't. It's reasonable to freak out after a near-death experience. Not that that was super near-death, but you know, closer than what you get walking through most doors. It's okay. I'm fine. Good. I had a whole argument prepared about labs and the risks of working with machinery and the importance of forgiveness. Do you want me to hit all the bullet points? Uh, that's not necessary. Are you sure? I practiced. No, I, I get it. I'm Ryan. I love how all these characters have so much personality. I like it. What do you do at the lab? I'm so sorry, but I have to ask why you're here. Why are you here? I'm Nancy Drew. I'm here to do due diligence for a potential new owner. I know, I left I'm sorry. Hanging. I'm an adult, and there's nothing funny about what you just said. Whoa, wait. Back to the information. We're getting a new owner? Maybe, but first I need to ask some intrusive questions. Oh. I know you've gotten enough of this, I really do, but it's my job. I've done <laughs> worse things my for my job. job. Like what? I build tools. They're not always used in a good way. What do you mean by that? I couldn't tell you about it if I wanted to. Confidentiality. Okay. Who do you think killed Nico? A little Love part it. of me thinks it's Gray. Why? I'm a little scared of him. Female engineer, quirky, cute, deaf twins. Uh, who's Kaylee Fryer? Who is that? Fryer. Oh! Oh, from Firefly. Wait, I do recognize her. I didn't watch that much Firefly, but I do know. I do recognize it. I see it. I like it. Him? Twinsies. He's not scary at all. Don't underestimate him. Those two had a strange relationship. They fought constantly. Not sure why. The part that was responsible for Nico's death is missing. Do you know where it went? No. Are you sure? You sound like you're not telling me something. I destroyed it. It's gone. Why destroy it? Because I made it! You know what? I need you to leave me alone right now. Go, please. Jeez. She destroyed evidence? Hmm. 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 Security office, do not remove. Interesting. Look, there's the last one, the O. Ooh, 
This could help getting into the lab. Yeah. Okay, we'll just take that. <laughs> I love how we just take stuff in these games. It's like, yoink, you don't need this, do you? <laughs> There's lots of tools if we need any tools. Hi. You Hi. snuck in without logging in the day before the murder. Why? I... I lost my key. It happens. Isn't this place extremely well secured? The labs are... Building... I have my tricks. And no, I'm not sharing. Goodbye. Later. She have little gummies? She seems so adamant to not talk to me. <laughs> and then she's like, hi. Is there anything else I can... Is this your oh. motorcycle? It's my sweet ride! But it's not done yet. But I'm working on it. Okay. Alright, well, we investigated Can't Brian. Can't check that off yet. Oh, we did it? Okay. Did that. We got a little key card. I wonder if we can use this now. Can't check that off yet. Still ha did still have to do that. Use a key card to get past a locked door. All right. Well, let's uh, let's try it. I guess. Blank card. If she can do it, we can do it. The actress, she's so cool. I feel like Miss Celine from Gilmore Girls. Oh my God, it's Natalie Wood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, where is... Wait, where's the lab again? No, that's Nancy's. Here, 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 here. Nope. Here. It's locked. Is it locked now? I guess this one doesn't work. Darn it! Okay, won't well, let me in. <laughs> okay, let's go... <laughs> Okay, I guess it's only during the night that he's there. Okay. Huh. All right, well, let's make it nighttime. <laughs> Look at the bedspread. <laughs> it's literally chocolate. <laughs> what the heck? Oh my goodness! Whoa, Jenny! Hey! <laughs> How are you guys? Whoa, thank you for that giant raid. Hi, everybody. We're uh, just playing a game called Nancy Drew. Hi. Hi, guys. How you doing? <laughs> yeah, just a lot. <laughs> Hi, guys. Nice to meet you. Thank you, Jenny, for raiding me. Hello. Hey there, Hi, camp. How's oh. my favorite buddy? I don't what know if do you, you guys want, have played Deirdre? Nancy Drew game, but we're what playing Nancy I Drew want? game, trying to figure out who's the murderer. It's about what you want, Nancy Drew. Is that so? It cannot be more so. Last thing I come Japan. bearing apologies. She's in Japan I want to help you, Nancy Drew. I want to be your girl on the inside of the exciting world of criminology. Why the sudden change of heart? Because apparently it still counts as plagiarism if you well, pay guys, someone to write your paper. A long time paper. no see, it has been I mean, a long time, Jenny. I mean, capitalism dead because that's what it seems like. And you, you come, want to help come, me because I made a bargain. If you come to Texas, let me know. If I can help an actual murder investigation, I'll get credit. So I help you, you help me collect data for my paper, and balance is restored to the universe. How exactly can you help me? I've got permission to use our criminal database. In fact, I already read up on the case. That could come in handy. All right, it's a deal. Great. I don't want to talk to her right and now. I'll do what I can. Just don't call me when I'm busy. Will do. Don't call me when I I'm better busy. get going. Hanging up. Yes. So for those that would like to watch, we're we're still at the very beginning of the game. We're trying to investigate who got murdered. There's a guy that was the co-owner. This guy, Nico Jovic, and he died from electrocution. And we have to figure out who the murderer is. <laughs> It's fun though. Kylie, you can teach Jenny how to drive to get her driver's license. I could do that. I'm a really good driver. I haven't been in an accident with knock on wood. 
Texas drivers are um, a little mean, but I can teach you how not that to be mean. That doesn't sound good. Ellie might want to know about this. Ooh, what does that sound? It's locked. Open it. What is the what is that sound? Should we tell the security guy? What do you guy? want? Is the hall just outside the lab supposed to hum? Depends. Depends. No, please, Jenny can't drive. Yeah, she can. I've seen her drive a boat. It's like the same thing. <laughs> sort of. Who was here the night of the murder? I was. Who else? Ellie and... And who? Computers say someone, but the cameras say no one else. Nico walks in that door alone every time I watch the tape. How many times have you watched the footage? Don't know. Lots. What if the footage Why? is like replaced? It's my or job. Something? Right? Yeah, same thing, right? <laughs> Boat, car, same thing. <laughs> so, what if somebody replaced the security video of the guy like going into the lab? Like, right? Or, I don't know. I guess, I guess the electricity is kind of. Never mind. Maybe not. What do you think of Ryan? Hater. Why? You're smart. Carry the sums. You'll get it. Everybody hates everybody in this game. Ellie hates Mason. Mason hates everybody. Nico hated everybody. The security guy hates everybody. What the heck? Everybody hates everybody. This would be a horrible work environment. You mentioned re-watching that video. Real disgruntled. Do you think Real. something is hidden there? Not hidden. Missing. What's missing? It's not a what. It's a who. I don't understand. Who are you looking for? Nico's killer. Do you think of me? What do you, what think, do you of think of Mason? Don't like him. Why not? <laughs> I've got my reasons. What are they? Secret. No, what the actually, heck? I hate him because he's up to something. What? I have no idea. Not for lack of trying. <laughs> How do you feel about this guy? Hate him. Why? Don't know why. <laughs> Did Nico's work put him in any danger? <laughs> yes. He's up Energy is power. Ultimate power. Power! Why would that put him in danger? People who want power will not hesitate to get what they want. Okay. Why were you so concerned about what Mason was up to? He was messing with tech he didn't understand. I had to make sure he didn't do anything stupid. The log says that one additional person entered the lab the night Nico died. I know. The question is, how do you know? Police report. What I don't understand is why the police didn't follow up on it. They did. Said it was a glitch. What? Do you believe that? What's it matter what I believe? It only matters what they believe. Goodbye. Okay. Bye. All right. Sounds good. Also, now that it's a little more calm and I can save... Um, let me do a little shout out for Jenny one second. So for, I know some of you guys probably already know Jenny, but I wanted to give her a shout out anyways. She is one of the coolest people I have ever met. She goes around the world and IRL streams her experience and she's just so fun to watch. Um, so if you want to go and check her out, please hit the follow button. She's, she literally goes everywhere around the world and she i've met her before and she's just the sweetest person ever and love it all good okay thanks Evan. anyways there you go i wanted to do that when it was a little bit more calm so y'all could see the, the i guess it, it notifies you at the top of chat but oh well um okay uh so i think i need to go to ellie to tell her about the creepy humming so let's go to ellie Big raid, yeah. <laughs> Jenny has a really big following. I mean, the stuff she makes is just really entertaining. It's fun to watch. I watch her. I didn't get to watch a lot of when she was in Japan. I watched her riding a boat recently, but I don't know if that was, I don't know how recent that was. I'm assuming it was recent though. Um, Ellie, oh wait, Ellie. Hi. Is the hall just outside the lab supposed to hum? 
Nope. <gasps> yes. Snooping. Who is this? A Connecticut Yankee in King Arthur's court. <gasps> what is this? Is this her password? Let's take a photo. Okay, is this a password for her computer? Well, let's find out. Whoa. Oh, her computer is still, whoa, coding! What? Does anybody know how to code? What is this? Okay. Well, her computer wasn't even signed out. I guess she didn't have time. These could be useful. We're just gonna take them? Oh, they're capacitors. <laughs> we just take this stuff? Oh, hey, cheer up, capital E. It can't be that bad. Okay, it can be that bad. I've been to Colorado, but on the bright side, I sent you a letter. See, you're holding it right now. Guess who got, just got her license? Jenny. Oh, just kidding. The answer is me. Madre and Padre were quite proud of the accomplishment and then slightly less proud when I got into an accident 30 minutes later. For 30 minutes, I had a perfect driving record. It was glorious. How's your super secret deal thing going? Also, can you please get a job where we don't always have to talk in secret code about everything? I know you don't want to talk about all of this, but I'm desperate to know if whatever it is you're doing is going to pan out. I look forward to the day I can say, and this is my fabulously wealthy yet brilliant humble cousin Ellie. I have to get going, but I have one more thing to say. Those jokers, Oh my god, that's so funny. That's how my friend talks. Those jokers. Those jokers in Colorado don't know what they're missing. I'm sorry that State's giving you a case of square peg syndrome, but it's not you. It's them. Anytime you get tired of life out there, you come home. I'll be waiting for you when we never, like we never skipped a beat. A hug and a high five, Rachel. Okay, Rachel. I'm guessing that's the girl that's also on her desk. Her cousin. Is there anything else I can, like, snoop? another password thing but I don't know um all these new people get to get to be here for a Nancy Drew day yeah <laughs> oh Lulu thank you for sub gifting a stirdroid stewdroid stewroid stewroid I think that's how you say it hello welcome it's time to snoop around yeah it doesn't seem like I can't do anything here on our computer. Um, and there's nothing else on her computer. So, well, I guess we snooped around. Let's see if we did. Still have to do that. Oh, it's still, still have to do that. Well, what else have I not snooped? It says it, it says snoop Ellie's workspace. I feel like I've snooped it. Unless there's something else. What am I missing? Yeah, this is, this is it. Trash can? Oh, it seems like I can't click the trash can. Oh, here we go, but I can click this. Oh, whoa, what was that? Reminder, hints to this month's passcode for the control booth. The red shape is pressed last. Okay, we'll figure that out later. Ooh, and a key. All right, let's just take that key. She's not gonna notice it. it's gone. <laughs> Still have to do that. Okay. Is there anything else? I need to find oh. a way to play this. Journal, late fall. Wow, we literally took everything. Okay. Check. Now we've checked. Now we've looked through her place. What about this, guys? Should we mess this stuff up? <laughs> I'm gonna mess all of his stuff up. Just so he's gonna freak out. Freak out, Mason. <laughs> okay. 
And he's gonna be like, who touched my stuff? <laughs> Even more drama. <laughs> now I'll give him a reason to really hate people. Um, all right. Did that. We inquired about it. Because we inquired, because that happened, we were able to get Ellie away, so that was a really nice. That was really nice. Meet everyone at the lab, investigate Ryan. Haven't done that. Still haven't done that, okay. That's Met done. everyone. All right, let's, um, let's get the security guard away, and let's go, let's go snoop. Let's go snoop. There, I think there's a couple of, like, things I can type out or something. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, we have to press this button. Wait, really, Azur? <laughs> okay. Um, oh, we don't have to log in again. That's great. Okay, so I got a couple of password or numbers here like we got the one I don't even know if this is needed but should I try this number one can somebody write this down for me in the chat so I can easily do it I love trying to figure stuff out with her oh was it like your older sister thank you one nine eight Two five seven one one two. Ah, uh, no. Hmm. Hmm. What was the passcode? Hold on, what was the code? So this was, maybe this is her ID code. So maybe this is Ellie's ID code. And maybe, oh, I didn't take a photo of Mason's, did I? Oh, here's Ryan's ID code. Hmm. Hmm. Hold on. Maybe we're supposed to put that in first. No, that didn't work. Here, let me try Ellie's. One, nine, eight, two, five, seven, one, one, two. No, that didn't work. We also have this key. Um, this, oh here, this is the, the number that was written on Mason's desk. I don't know. Four, seven, two, one, two, five. Oh, nothing's working. Do you think the periodic table could have one of the passwords? Uh, <laughs> maybe? I wouldn't put it past it. Can't leave the card behind. Oh. I don't know, did that card, like, putting in that in there, did it, like, activate the card? Here, let's find out. No, it didn't work. It's locked. But I have a key. It's locked. No. Okay, this is a periodic table. I don't know what we would look for though. Do you think the numbers, like the, maybe. Should we try the number that was the key card, the night of the murder? I don't know if that's gonna work. So H, O, B, Hob, H H no I don't think so. <laughs> Nightmare table. Nancy Drew is smarter than me. No, she's not. It can only be in numbers. 
I don't know. I feel like this is probably going to be used for something else. But I'm not sure. Um, what did that say? It, was that the security guard? Did y'all hear that? In case of... In case of stairs, you're in the wrong lab. Um, where did we, f where did we see this key? Oh, maybe here? No. Is there any keyhole that we saw? that needed, or any lock that needed a key. I'm trying to think about it. I mean, Ellie has it, so. Was there anything locked on Ellie's desk or Mason's desk? Or maybe it was Ryan's, maybe it has something to do with Ryan's little area, but it's locked. Um, let's make it, let's make it daytime. Maybe we can ask her questions during the day. No. <laughs> you didn't do good in chemistry? Chemistry was pretty hard. Or should we go, should we go? The humming is gone. Hold on, hold on. Let's go ask, maybe let's go ask Ellie questions. The humming's gone, maybe she fixed it. Oh, Nancy? What's up? How bad are relations between you and Mason? I wouldn't say they're bad. You might be the only one who wouldn't. They're not great. I get the impression that you two hate each other. My gram raised me to look for the good in everyone, even those who do me harm. Most times I find that glimmer of good even in the meanest people. But Mason flashes that smug smile of his, and every rage center of my brain releases all of its hate Mason chemicals. Wish that weren't the truth, but it is. Dang, okay. I also get the impression Mason doesn't like you very much. Now that is fortunate. If I had to deal with him puppy-dogging all around all the time, I'd never get anything done. Puppy-dogging? Who else was here the night Nico died? Gray. I think that's it. Did you know Nico well? No, but it wasn't for lack of trying. So you weren't friends? I don't know if he had friends. He wasn't well liked? No, it's not like that. I just don't think he needed people. Or if he did, then he hid it well. He was too much of a scientist. Mm -hmm. They're crazy for each other. <laughs> you said Nico was too much so. of a scientist. What did you mean by that? I'm organized in the way I think, but I... Okay, take Mason, for example. He lives his life the way I work. How so? In all of the ways. When he makes a sandwich, he alphabetizes the ingredients. He's not human. Not that he's... It's hard to explain. Like if a computer had legs and a sweater, it'd be Mason. What it comes down to is, I'm 20%. Mason, maybe 60. Nico was 100% a scientist. Why do you and Mason work opposite schedules? I'm a night Ellie. Any other reason? And as a good Southern girl, I know if you don't have anything good to say, you keep it zipped, like this. Did Nico have a hard time with people? Not a hard time, not exactly. It was like he was plugged into a different current than the rest of us. People were to be studied and observed, but that was all he wanted. At least I hope that's how it was. Was Nico close to anyone in the office? Did he talk to anyone? Don't think so, really. I'll let you go. Goodbye, Nancy. All right, well, that's done with her. Wait, let's go call Deirdre. Call her back. I love that 
We're going to be working with hey there, Nancy Day. Drew. What do you know about surveillance video? That you watch it? Have you heard of cases where the video has been faked? Oh, yeah. All the time. How can you tell if the video has been edited in some way? It's getting harder and harder to tell. But the number one thing you need to do is to make sure that you've got the original video feed. If you don't, analyzing the data file isn't going to do you much good. Is there a way to know if I have the original? Yeah, that's the detective part. Not in my wheelhouse. See, I'm telling you, I think that's what happened. It's a fake video. I need you to check on 911 calls the night of the murder. Consider it done. I'll text you the results. What's up? Ryan's been sneaking into the facility. I think she might be trying to avoid ending up in the security logs. Just spitballing here. But do you think you could take her in a fair fight? What kind of question is that? The kind of question you ask someone who is kicking it with killers. You seem pretty certain she's guilty. The first thing you learn in criminology is that most cases are easy. The person who looks guilty usually is. You read up on the case, right? I don't understand why Ryan was under so much scrutiny but never sent to trial. From what I gathered, something didn't add up with the video and the timeline. Someone had to be in the lab with Nico. Otherwise, he'd still be here today. So, if her alibi stands up, it couldn't be her. Exactly. Unless there's something big I'm missing. Something's weird about said this that whole she thing. That was her. Well, don't keep me in suspense. Figure this out. I asked her about the night of the murder. She was pretty much mute. I'm undercover here. I can't push too hard. Can you see what you can find on your end? I'll see what I can find. All I've got is the database. Don't expect any miracles. Right. Um, what do we do now? Find a way to listen to the audio card. Yeah, I don't know how to do that. Still have to do that. Can't check. Ha Still have to do that. Hmm. All right, well, let's go back. Let's go back to Ryan and see if there's any area I can unlock because I can't remember what, what it looked like inside her little space. And maybe she has something I can read. Oh, what's this? Heard back about the 911 call. Guess who waited 30 minutes before calling in the accident? According to time of death reports, according to time of death reports, Ellie, that's who. I wonder what she was doing. Probably covering her murder's tracks. I mean, who does that? Stylishly late doesn't apply to 911 calls. Before you ask, that's all I know about this. Wow, she waited 30 minutes to call 911? It's kind of crazy. Also, wait a second. Can this play? A track? Here, eat, eat this. Eat this and tell me what it says. Darn it. I need oh. to find a way to fix this. I need to find a way to fix this. I need to fix it. Maybe that's how I can read the file. But I don't, I don't know how to fix it. Let's uh, make it daytime. Wasn't there something in the office to play a card? The dead guy's office? We saw at the beginning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. <gasps> Who's there? Hello? Who was that? What the heck? I need to go pee. Four stars me. would visit again. Okay. Um, who was trying to get into Nancy's room? That was creepy. Hmm. That was so creepy. What the heck? Okay. Should we like, oh, security's gone. It's Victor. <laughs> I 
want to get in the lab, darn it. Get me in the lab! Alright, let's go and talk to Ryan. <laughs> it's the robotic cat we haven't found. <laughs> I see a piece of its arm, like, on the table, so... <laughs> I'm wondering if we're gonna have to like fix, like, find the pieces and then fix it. Ah! Oh my god! What the. What? What's happening? Are you okay? <laughs> I'll never be okay again! What oh, is that thing? An abomination of technology. It's some creepy robotic cat that someone, I suspect Mason, is tormenting me by leaving all of its awful parts everywhere. I've seen one of those before. If I find all of the pieces, I bet I, I can put it right. together. As long as you promise to throw it into a fiery volcano once it's completed. That thing is the undisputed mayor of Nightmare Town. Do you know how I can <laughs> play a media card? <laughs> yeah, Nico's personal player. I meant to fix it earlier. Get me some Coco Malas from Nico's office, and I'll have it working for you. From the candy machine? How exactly does that thing work? Here, this should do the trick. Nice. Thanks. I better get going. Later. Okay. The fact that she has something from the security office is really suspicious. Alright, let's go back to the guy's office and get her a Coco Malo. <laughs> and then we're gonna have to find fix a robotic cat. Sounds kind of fun. All right, here we go. Is this like Simon Says kind of thing? What is a cook? Oh, these things, I guess. Hmm. It looks like a memory lock. I'm the worst at these. what Ryan wanted. I want another one! Perfect! Okay. Alright, let's go give it to her. <laughs> Old game of Simon Says. Yeah. I hate those games. <laughs> What's up? Here's the candy bar you wanted. Great. I'll start fixing it right now. Nice. Okay, so now we can listen to the diary. Oh, ooh, we can snoop through her stuff. Okay, we're just gonna take the robotic cat head. All right. Is there anything else? Can we take any tools? What is this piece of paper? Okay, we already got everything in there. Can't take that. Hmm. 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 Can we look at our motorcycle? No. Can't check that off yet. That's done. All right, wait, is there anything else I can, like, get? I guess it was just the headpiece, so never mind. 
Nothing else over here? Nope. Okay. Alright, well, we have to find the robotic cat pieces. Um, I believe... There's Mason. See, there's one right here. And what are then... you doing? Oh, right. We can't go there. Yes. Oh, he look. He fixed his stuff. Who do you see on an average day? You look a little Just upset. Just me. Sometimes Ryan. You ask a lot of questions. Ever thought of being a scientist? Sometimes. Good answer. The world needs more people with questions, and fewer people who are sure they have the answers. Do you like Ryan? Let me save you some time. I don't like anyone. That can't be true. Observe, and I'll demonstrate. Oh. Other people. <laughs> okay. Have you been tormenting Ryan with a robot cat? I'd never do something that hilarious and definitely deserved. Never. Not ever. Okay, so Don't you have... think you should maybe stop? She seems to hate it. He's so sarcastic. Mm, no, I will not stop. I asked her nicely to build it for me. I even offered to pay her for her time. She's the one who hid it, so I don't even feel a little bad. You look a little upset. Someone moved my things. Someone will pay. <laughs> God! Someone will pay. <laughs> Bye. See you later. All right, it's going to be my goal to constantly mess this stuff up. What are you doing? Ah! It's so funny, though. <laughs> Why does he say it like that? All right. Great voice acting. I think it's good, too. It's fun. <laughs> Someone will pay. Alright, uh, there was a piece of the cat here. Yeah, I've seen that one. So we got the head and the arm. There's like a whole other section that we gotta find though. Like the body. Um, did she fix it? Oh, it's fixed. Okay, here we go. All right, so this was Nico's diary. It's Wednesday. I've clocked 49 hours of work this week. I found another note from Ryan on my door this morning. This time a threat. She continues to surprise. She's smarter than she looks. And then later she confronted me by the couch in the lounge and handed me another of her threats. I didn't bother taking it with me. Whoa, Ryan was threatening Nico? What the heck? Wait, why did Ellie have this? The coil as is, it's little more than a plaything. I can't get the proper flow using the original design. I've got schematics drawn up for an entirely new prototype, but maybe that step isn't necessary. The math is solid, and the small scale experiments are running at an efficiency of about 80%, and that's using the old design. Seems like a... A what? Wait, how do you say that, Madrona? I bet they weren't actual threats and you just assume they were. Maybe it was like threats of like, hey, if you don't fix this, like it's going to explode. Maybe that's what, yeah. Hmm. I checked in on Mason's oh, work herring. today. He has the strangest attraction to exactly the work I'd most like him to avoid. I'm starting to question if he knows what he's toying with. I've made my message to him clear. Yet he keeps going back to the rough materials application portion of the process. Perhaps it's time Gray tightens up the network to keep him in line. Maybe it's time to replace him. He's been less of an asset than I expected anyway. Dang. I'm finding myself spending more and more time down in my study in a state somewhere near sleep. Viewing the schematics in my mind. Looking for flaws. Doesn't make sense that I'm finding none. Okay. Alright, well we Check. listen to it. Investigate Ryan's threats against Nico. Yeah, let's go ask her. Why are you threatening him? Ha ha, tell me willingly. I won't tell the police. No way. You're fine. Hi. Mason says he was tormenting you with a cat because you hid it. Is that true? 
It was self-defense. Fuzzy little freak ball had it coming. I'll let you go. Bye. Hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> a warning, not a threat. It didn't. It, she didn't want to talk about it, or I guess Nancy didn't want to talk about it. All right, let's make it nighttime. I always like doing these in Nancy games, where you can like set what time of day it is to investigate. I always like that. Delirium, thank you so much for the 99 months. Good day. How's your Monday? We still don't know who came to our room and pounded on the door. Also, I just noticed this. There's like little plants right here hanging. That's cute. Alright, let's um let's go to Mason's area first. Big chillin'. Glad I can catch a stream. I'm glad you're here too. All right, let's go mace. Let's go mess up Mason's stuff again, <laughs> and take this. Okay, I messed up his stuff again. Is there anything new in his trash? No. But that's still only three pieces. Hello. Goodbye. Goodbye, Nancy. Does she have the body anywhere? And we also still have this bin key, but I don't know what the bin key is for. Do we go talk to the security guy? <laughs> no, let's go mess with Mason. <laughs> Gotta find a bin somewhere. Has there been a bin that we've seen? Maybe it's in the maybe it's in the lab. Cat is alive. Schrodinger's cat is alive. The are they, is this the cat that we were referring to earlier? Yeah, Maybe what? Oh, I God, better okay. get going. Bye. Have you been able to get in the lab yet? No, I do have a blank card, but I haven't been able to figure out the passcode. Unless it has something to do with these F, Z, R, O thingies. But it's just like a number. Here, let's get them out and we can see it again. He's probably so sick and tired of us doing that. <laughs> run, run away. So there's, what was this one? D, F, Z, R. But I think when we do this, see, it just says password. But we don't know the but we don't know the password. At least I tried entering the the card number the night of the murder. I tried to do the one that was written on Mason's desk. And I also tried the one that was on um, Ellie's desk. But none of them worked. Wait, was there one on Ryan's? We did find the key card in Ryan's. Wait, we did find the key card in Ryan's. What do the three circles mean? I don't know. That's why I don't think it's related. Oh, you think so, Lulu? One of the letter stickers? Oh, yeah, Ryan's workshop, there was one. It was an O, and it was on, like, the little, like, um...
Oh shoot, hold on. Oh, sorry, one second, guys. Um, we, we, bloop, bloop, bloop. Okay, I don't understand. Anyways, um, th it was like a little, like, remote control. So, I don't know, there, that is one. But the, e but even when we, Oh, there are letters. What am I saying? But we don't know the order of the letters, so... Unless it spells out a word, I guess. Uh. Hmm. There's gotta be something I'm missing. I could literally hit this question mark. Can't check that off yet. Look, they changed the hint thing. I like this better. Should I ask for a hint? Is there anyone we need to call? Um, we can probably call Frank and Joe. We haven't actually talked to them yet. Whoa, what, Evan? Whoa, what is that? Wait, are you referring to... This? I love the hint button. I know, right? Here, wait a second. They're all the same numbers. So maybe we can figure out who is who? I don't know. Oh, one five. Okay, so this was Mason. Oh, this is probably what this is for. Uh, I scrambled the numbers around and made three sets of 15. I don't know what it means though. Oh, I think that's just her key, her key number. You said one nine, what was the, what was her number? One nine eight. I don't know why I'm looking there. Um, one nine eight. I'm thinking it's just her, her key. So we know like who is who. There's a lot of 20358. That could be Nico. So maybe the 229. Maybe. Mm, maybe the 229 is Brian's? Can somebody write this name, this number down? The 229320913? Maybe that's the password. I don't know. I'm gonna give it a shot. And if not, you can ask for a hint. I'm not above not a not asking for hints. Because we did find this key card in Ryan's workshop. So I'm thinking it's whatever her password is. But this is not even a password. It's just a ID. Eh, I didn't do anything. All right, let's, let's see. Haven't done that. Take a good look around Gray's office. Okay, so wait, I think you're right. So we got, okay. All right, this is the password. <laughs> All right, never mind. Okay, so we got WG, I'm gonna write it in my notes. WGG. Can't leave the card behind. Oh, you? Hmm. You. Is there any other ones there? Oh, HQ. HQ right here on the trash can. C R F. Uh, v D. And I believe the last one was O, because that was the, right? That was the one on the remote. So what does that spell? What does that spell, guys? <laughs> the arrows have to mean something like a position. But this one's like pointed like northwest. Or maybe it means, 
Like, oh, maybe it means like whatever this number would be in like the order. Oh wait, actually, yeah. That's what I'm thinking too, okay. If you arrange them all in the circle. All right, well, we got F blank, or no, Z blank F. Let's find the one, oh, V. So it's Z, V, F. So maybe it doesn't even say a word. Okay. Z, V, F. So we need to find the one that goes, oh wait, no, and then R. So these are all kind of connected, okay. The one before the Z is H. Q is the one pointing directly down. H, Z, V, F, R, W. Get out of there. Ah! He scared me! Oh no, we got caught! <laughs> no! <laughs> ah, he scared me! Alright, guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna take a photo of all of them. <laughs> And then I and then I can go somewhere else and we can we can do this. <laughs> it scared me. Why am I so jumpy today? Like that was like the second time. Darn it. <laughs> Can't leave the card behind. Darn you. Nancy. Trying to figure out the password. We need time, okay? I can't work under this Pressure. Memory fool. What? Okay. I'll delete this. I don't think I need that. We can only have 12 pictures. What is this nonsense? Should I delete that? I feel like. I'm gonna keep it, because of this thing. We don't need this one anymore. I can just snoop through Mason's stuff. Oh, okay. Kill, but whatever. Okay. All right. Before he freaks out. All right. Let's go. Wait. We're on the bottom floor, aren't we? <laughs> All right. Let's make it daytime and let's go figure out the one on the little remote. <laughs> Eight megabyte storage. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> it's so small. <laughs> Was there any other letters that? we have seen. <laughs> Hi, PJ. It seems like we can figure out the password anytime. I just need to know all the letters. Here. All right. Okay. So we, the first one is V, it's pointing directly up. So we're just gonna start at V and then go around, okay? So V, and then it was Z, no wait, sorry, F. So V, F, R, W. Oh, I think O is the next one. O. What's this one? South. East. D. 
Okay, and then directly down was... What was directly down? Q. And then we need a southwest. G. G, two Gs, two GG. A GG. And then we need it pointing to the west, which is U. And then the one above the west. H. And then the one before the north was Z. Okay, we got them all. H, Z, V, R, or H, Z, V, F, R, W, 0, D, Q, G, G, U. But how do we know where it starts? <laughs> and that spells. <laughs> um, how do we know where it starts? Like, what does it start? Do we start north and then go? I need to use the restroom real quick, so one second. Hold on. back. I got a clip to match my shirt because my hair was bothering me. Okay. Did we, what do we, um, what do we, do we figure out what order? <laughs> I topped that. Hmm. <laughs> You're just topping what I was saying earlier, right? With the hub -dub 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 -dub. Hmm. So we have all the letters, but we just gotta figure out the right order. Hi. Bye. Bye. Later. Later. Hmm. Is it, is it supposed to be like common sense? Are we supposed to know? Are we supposed to know? I don't think we're supposed to know. 
Are we supposed to know the order? I don't think we're supposed to know the order. Because... Uh, Like, this didn't say anything, right? I mean, it does say... Wait a second, maybe this is it. But what, is that west? Maybe it starts west? Maybe it starts west. Maybe that's, that's what we should go with? I literally thought this had something to do with the password, though. You think that was for the red and blue circles? Yeah, I think you're right. So maybe that's not what it was. There's so many combinations we could do too, though. So I'm not sure. Is there any other hint? Hmm. What if I ask for another hint? Oh, that's the only Haven't thing done I give you. <laughs> Hello, Dirk. Hello. It says binaries under it. Yeah. Can we fix the cat yet? Hmm. Hmm. Oh, maybe not. Also, th this is something where we're gonna have to do something with this, but I don't know. I don't know what. A scandal in Colorado. Mind over matter. Hmm. Maybe we can call Deirdre. Maybe she found uh -huh. something else out. I nope. better get going. What about the Hardy Boys? We could call them. Nancy, Frank was just talking about you. Oh yeah? Is that so? We haven't talked just to them yet. recounting the time. So how are you? How's Colorado? Sciency. Awesome. Not bad. I want to catch you up on the case. Give us the deets. Joe, there's already a word that means what you're trying to say. Frank, it's a language, not a museum. Tear down the velvet rope standing in the way of your word imagination. <sighs> word so, imagination. Sorry, Nancy. Please go ahead. I was called in to solve a cold case murder. Whoa, a murder? I am flabber worried. Isn't that a little on the dangerous side? It might be. I wish we could be there to help. Where are you? We're on a submarine. Well, currently it's a boat, but intermittently it's a submarine. What are you doing on a submarine? It's sort of a long story, and we're still putting the pieces together. Not gonna lie, Nancy, it's some pretty sweet stuff. Crime syndicates, pirate treasure, and there's some talk of pirate ghosts. But no confirmations as of yet. But fingers crossed. More importantly, you know? tell us about you. Okay, here's the full scoop. Victor, the lab owner, called me in to help solve a cold case. Wow. Why did he call you? Isn't this a job for the police? Well, that's the thing. The police hit a dead end, and Nico, the researcher who was killed, all of his papers were put into evidence. And they stay in evidence until the case is closed, right? Exactly. What makes the papers so important? Apparently, Nico was very close to making his research public. The research was supposedly going to revolutionize the way power is created and delivered in this country. Well, the world, really. <laughs> Victor, you, Victor wants the papers released before anyone else connects the dots. If it's such a big deal, how come he didn't go to some big private eye or something? Joe, probably because Nancy's got a very well-deserved reputation of being yeah, the best there is. Joe. I'm sorry, Nancy. I didn't mean it that way. It just seems like a really big job. I thought the same thing, trust me. But he thinks because of my age, no one will suspect I'm undercover. I hope he's right. Oh, undercover. That makes sense. Cool. Keep us up to date. We'll do everything we can to help. Um, can you tell me how to... Oh, right. No. Nope. I better get going. I just have to tell Bye. him everything that's happened. <laughs> well, I want to talk to Victor. 
Victor here. Oh my god. Should I talk to him? Oh my god, there's so much to talk to him about. Can you tell me a little bit about Ellie? She's got that small town girl act down, Pat. I guess I just can't tell who she really is. Did you know about Nico's diaries? I knew he kept audio notes in his office. He had a player there. No clue how it works. Mason says Nico was stealing from him. Is this true? No, because the work isn't Mason's to begin with. It's a little troubling that he views it that way. How did you hear about me? Through a close friend. You've impressed a lot of people, Nancy. You seem pretty sure Ryan's the one who killed Nico. That's because she did. She made the part that malfunctioned and killed Nico. And confidentially, the police told me they're almost certain it's her. They just don't have enough evidence to get a conviction. This is your case. But don't let Ryan's buddy act fool you. She's not who she seems. What do you think of Mason? Smart kid. Don't know much about him. Why did you hire me and not a big investigation firm? The crew has been questioned a lot, as you can imagine. Everyone's defenses are up. You can pull off the undercover work without drawing too much suspicion. I know it's a long shot, but I've heard good things. And... I already tried the by-the-book way, and that got me nowhere. Can you tell me anything about Gray? I don't know much about it's him. It's not an accident. He was one of Nico's hires. Nico brought Gray Please. on? Yes, I have no idea on. why. He's a head case. Watch yourself around him. Understand? Do you think Gray could have killed Nico? I don't know if he did, but I don't doubt he could have. Between you and me, if I didn't want him here to be investigated, I would have fired him immediately. Do not tell him that. I don't know how he might react. He could be really ugly. Can you tell me a little bit about Nico? He was an amazing scientist. Years ahead of his time. How long have you worked together? Decades. Did you spend any time together outside of work? I don't know if there was much outside of work for Nico. So, no. Bye. Uh, Talk to talking, you later. Uh, talking people didn't get me anywhere, unfortunately. Should we. Did we ask Ellie about this? About how she took 30 minutes to call 911? I don't think we did, did we? She's a nighttime person, though. So maybe we should make it nighttime? I think it just made it daytime, though, so whatever. How many days have passed? Here, let's go see if we can talk to her about it. Why did you take 30 minutes to call 911? What were you doing? Wait, I guess we couldn't ask her that because then she's going to be so suspicious of us, right? We're supposed to be undercover and we're literally going to be asking her. Oh, Nancy? Yeah, see, What's we can up? ask her that. Darn I it. better get going. Bye. But you know what I can do? Um, haven't done that. Can't check. Have still have to do that. Darn it! Yeah, I don't. I don't know how to figure out that password. Hmm. Should we? Should we take a little break, Aroni here, though, chat? And go and get lunch. I'm actually pretty hungry. Still haven't figured out what this key is for, though. Here, let's save. Um, password for key card. I have that saved in my phone. I was saving it. I have, have key. Oh, I, well, I guess do it. <laughs> Cause we'll have to figure it out. 